Is that camera on here? <laughs> I don't know. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you today? Hope you're doing well. So we have got a mic. I don't best not touch it. We have got a mic today. I've got a new mic because my camera mic is like dodgy as anything, but um, just let me know how we get on with that and we'll move on from that. I don't know why I'm telling you about a mic, but there we go. So I am going to be doing favourites, July favourites. I, not July, June, sorry. I haven't done a favourites video in a long time and I really used to love doing them on my old channel. I know this is a new one, so like, you know. So yeah, let's let's just uh, get into it. Don't forget, you need to subscribe to see more from me. I upload once a week and then I upload shorts pretty much every day apart from Wednesdays. So the first favourite I'll have to say is my new room and my new decor. I have been decorating my bedroom and this is going to be my filming setup now. I love these like shelves. I've got like my witchy shelf. I love it. But to see the room, you just get a little sneak peek. There will be a video coming up next week of the full decor. Honestly, there's still a few little bits I need to do. But once it's done, guys, you're going to love it. I love it already. Like it makes me feel better being in this room. Anyway. Let's move on. So I have got a few different bits and bats, but we'll just we'll just get on with it so the first thing first is this this is the fenty skin total cleanser i adore this it smells incredible i can't tell you what it smells like but it smells incredible but this removes everything but it doesn't feel like it's stripping the skin you know like some cleansers you feel like it's taking too much off or like it feels like it's stripping this it feels quite nice and gentle and it removes most of your makeup the only thing i find it struggles with is like your p louise paints which honestly i like i don't know anything that gets rid of p louise paint so but yeah that's my first one next we've got this this is the wild deodorant i oh my god it's just come out like that uh the wild deodorant um this isn't sponsored or anything like that they haven't even sent me it um, but I basically I, I get eczema on my armpits so I thought do you know what I'm going to try something that's natural it's not going to um, hopefully not irritate my skin and it works really well but it smells it smells really nice for a like an aluminium you always think they're going to smell a bit granified because I've had them before and they smell very old this smells nice smells sweet guys if you haven't smelled this you need to smell this it's the lush let the good times roll body spray I need to spray some on. I need to. Oh, it's incredible. It smells like popcorn. Popcorn, but like a sophisticated popcorn, like a grown up popcorn. Like caramelly. But it lasts all day. You only need a few sprays and it's oh, sincere. And every time I wore this, I've always had people like stop me going, oh, that smells really nice. What's that? always this it's incredible next we've got this so this is my crystal necklace i've got citrine in it at the minute it's basically one where i can like change it so i've got oh i dropped the crystal no so i've got all my other crystals there and i can just change i've got a broken crystal now that's great but yeah i can just change it out as and when i need it but i've been loving this one at the minute it's really nice and i i, I have been wearing this pretty much every day in fact i've worn it that much that i've snapped the actual clasp which is you know, not ideal, but we move. Right, let's move on to makeup. So we have base products. So this is the Collection Gorgeous Glow Filter Finish. This is pretty much the same thing as the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. If there's not really much in it, apart from this is about seven pounds, whereas the Charlotte Tilbury one's like 33 or something like that. This is insane. It is so nice. And if you're looking for a cheaper alternative this one will definitely do i blame tiktok on this though 100 percent. next the nars light reflecting foundation this foundation is insane like it gives me nice coverage but not too much it don't feel cakey it don't feel like i've got anything on it just hydrates the skin it makes me look glowy makes me look healthy and that is all i'm wanting from a foundation this is incredible incredible stuff next we've got the xx revolution cream bronzer I have been using this for quite a while and honestly every time I use it I forget why I stopped using it or like put it down or whatever I'm like why did I stop it is like the softest cream bronzer I think I've ever used it just blends into the skin it doesn't look too much it doesn't look too orange it just blends beautifully I, I absolutely adore this product next we've got a brow combination so it's basically it <laughs> can't get my words out any brow gel but i have been loving the got to be one at the minute i really like the unicorn cosmetics one as well but any brow gel and then the nyx lift and snatch brow pen in fact i need to buy a new one because i'm slowly running out i will like 
because that was it today. I love it. It's the easiest, quickest brow I have ever done. It is insane. And it's pigmented as well, but without being too pigmented because it's meant to make, like create brow strokes. I don't know. Yeah, you will be able to see it. It's just there. It's quite soft, but it, it, it still packs a punch that you can see it. Next, we've got the... Do I cook it? Next, we've got the Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess. Again, this is just so soft and beautiful. I've got it in the shade 2 Medium. It just... It's got that colour where it makes you look like you've caught sun. It doesn't look like you're just orange. I, I love it. It's almost got like a reddish tinge to it without being too red. Next, we've got a mascara. The Monsieur... Monsieur? 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 Monsieur Big. Um, look, I have terrible lashes. So when I find a mascara that works, I cling on to it with my dear life. I've tried other ones. I've tried to find different... I always seem to go back to this one. It just actually works for my lashes. It's incredible. So if you've got chicky, crappy, small lashes, know which one to try. P. Louise Cut Carver. I didn't think I'd like this. Like, I thought, do you know what? <laughs> I much prefer, like, Vaseline, and I'll stick with that. This is just so much smoother. It works so much better, and a little bit goes a long way. And it smells like, it smells like coconut. It smells like coconut, which convinces me it's just coconut oil, but... I think there's a little bit more in it, but it is really nice. And plus it's cute. It reminds me of Polly Pocket. So I've only had this product for a short amount of time. It's shorter than any other product I've had. So I've only had this product for like a short amount of time, but I am in love with it. It's the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe Divine Neutral Palettes. I am not a big fan of Morphe palettes. Um, I tend to find them very hit and miss um but i will basically i was doing someone's makeup at work and i used this on them i thought you know what i need to have it it is stunning the pigment the pigment here pigmentation's incredible it blends really nice and you know what i lack neutral palettes sometimes i look at my palettes and think i have got no neutrals why now i do next is this it's the lip oil from p louise in the shade indulge me this with any sort of deeper lip liner i just love it especially indulge me it's like a brownie color but it it comes off clear do you know what i mean like it doesn't show up brown it smells incredible it makes your lips feel really nice and good old lip liner you can't go wrong next we have quite an expensive product this is the Meron makeup face paint palette effectively i've been on i've been eyeing this palette up for years years and i finally bit the bullet i got it i think i got it on like for 120 and it went on an offer it's only like around 140. it's insane anytime i've been doing bright colorful looks chances are i've been either using i've been using this um i've done face painting events i've used this it's easy to clean it's easy to use the pigmentation's good it smells like coconut which i like that so this is it's definitely a splurge but it's 100 and then last but not least is the Good Vibes, Good Life book. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I haven't been reading this book. I've been listening to it on um, Audible because I'm not, I'm, I'm dyslexic. I'm not a good reader, but I have got the book because I kind of like, like it. But yeah, um, it's it's changing my life slowly but surely. It's insane. Give it a read or a listen. It's Anyway guys, that was my June favourites video. If you like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up. Like, share, comment and don't forget to subscribe to see more from me. Bye guys.